Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another wonderful G-Dubs Collects video today. And I want to talk about this box right here. No, not just the complete set purple edition from Target that includes the one exclusive Chrome Rookie Image Variation card, which could look like this. I don't want to talk about just this box in general. I want to talk about this box. You know how they say, don't judge a book by its cover. Well, I bought a number of these boxes and I was talking about how you want to make sure that this side of the box is intact because this card, this Chrome card right here, this one right here is actually located right right here so you want to make sure it's good and uh and i checked the the first box that i did very thoroughly and the next box i forgot to check until i was already recording so i just ran with it i i, I rolled with the punches and i uh i just powered right through but in the video you'll note that i i i mentioned this corner here had i seen this corner all right I most likely would have tried to buy another box and return this because this this is what you don't want to see because if it gets scrunched this way, so if this side of it right here was a little bunched up, you'd probably be okay because all the cards are stacked like this. So you're just kind of pushing up against the rest of the cards. But the fact that this corner clearly was dinged right here and it scrunches this up and more importantly this right here look at how compromised that corner is let me focus this up that is a a brutal corner had i seen this i most likely would have returned it and i'm here to tell you maybe maybe that's not the best idea so this was an exclusive video i opened it up on my igtv but I wanted to post it here as well with a little recap. So take it away, G-Dubs Collects. Tell me, what are we talking about here? Hello, ladies and gentlemen. G-Dubs Collects with an exclusive Instagram video today. Um, I have a couple videos on YouTube. If you haven't already seen them, check it out. I'm doing a full break of this, quote-unquote break. But here we are, little 2020 complete baseball set. Not just one, but two. So, that was backwards. <laughs> but two, here we go. So there we go. Um, so, uh, I don't want to do a full video. I just want to do a quick little uh, clip here because in the other videos, go check them out. We do a full uh, review so you can see all of the variants you can see um, all the rookies that are in here and uh, a complete breakdown so yeah let me let me keep it on screen so you can tell all right so there it is so you don't think I'm stacking the deck here so um, this one this is what you kind of kind of want to watch out for um, but I, I was looking at it and I think it's okay the exclusive card is right here so uh you want to make sure that they this side of the box is in really good condition because it's just sitting in there unprotected but um the this corner doesn't look actually too compromised because uh it looks like it kind of pushed in so it should be okay um if it was kind of hit from this side i'd be a little bit more worried so Anyway, we are going to open this up. We are, of course, hoping to get a little, uh, and see, look, there you can see it's actually, it's in good condition, so we're all right. Um, let me focus that right there. Um, so right on top, you can see they have just the, uh, the, the variant pack, uh, and that's got the, the five big rookies in there. But you also have the addition of this card right here and we are hoping for either a Bo Bichette or a Luis Robert. So we got Bo Bichette, baby. There we go. Awesome. 
That's exactly who we wanted. Beautiful card. Great condition. No dings. Slight little white right there, but that's actually... Yeah, that's not on the card, so we're good. Great condition, but yeah, you definitely want to watch out for uh, for that corner and make sure that it's uh, it's not something that's compromised because that's your that's your money making corner. So again, comes with the, uh, the the rookie variants right there, but that one card was really what we were searching for. So we are uh, we're one for one on the cards that we want. Obviously, if you can get two Luis Robert, that's even better. But uh, for me personally, I wanted a, a Beau Bichette for my personal collection. So. So that's excellent, and we are going to take a look at this one now. And now hopefully we go two for two, and hopefully this is a Luis Robert. So this one, much better condition on the corner. This is a little dinged up down here, but that's more of just like, you can kind of see it's just like the cut marks, so we're okay there. This corner, that's okay. It looks worse uh, than it is, um, so you just really want to, all right, so that's that's not great, but again, it kind of crushed inward. Um, but these got sent. Uh, Target doesn't really send these too well, so that's not not spectacular. But uh, I'm hoping, like I said with the last one, that it's more of a hit this way, and as opposed to a hit that way. So here we go. Hopefully, we got a nice intact Luis Robert. And it does look like it's in good condition, so that's great. But boy, that uh, that really woo, woo, that's a close one. Thankfully, they are kind of pushed in here, and we get Gavin Lux. So not the super name that we wanted, but uh, this actually is a. <laughs> I didn't even realize that. That is a gold one of one Gavin Lux. I was just looking at it. I was like, that looks a little a little shimmery to me. Holy moly. Wow. Now I'm regretting a little bit that this is an Instagram only video, but not really because now I'm sharing it with you guys. Holy moly. Woo. That's that's a big card. Tops, you uh you stepped up your game a little bit with uh with the variations this year for the uh the the uh complete completed set. You're really uh making people wanna wanna go out and buy these. So I'm gonna actually just just in case I'm gonna double check the rest of these here. So uh as you as you know, you wanna pull this out just a little bit, give yourself some room, and you don't wanna hear any any dragon on the way up but uh, no nothing nothing uh, different with these but uh, wow that's uh, that's really nice I didn't know that they had the super refractors like that uh, this Beau Bichette obviously just just regular but this Gavin Lux uh, one of one um, not bad holy moly all right we're gonna have to do a little post on that too <laughs> that was great all right thank you guys for tuning in today uh if you go check out my video so you can get the full recap of these um this year more than ever this is almost a must buy for uh for for any collector because it's such a loaded year you get minimum two rookie cards each of some of the biggest stars obviously the, the two biggest stars uh, Randy Rosarina and um, Kyle Lewis. Uh, the uh, Kyle Lewis probably going to win Rookie of the Year. Not featured in these variations, but um, this is still a very, very strong rookie class. So I would highly recommend going out and getting one of these, especially because apparently you can pull some really big cards. Except you can't pull this card because it's the only one that exists. So there we go. Have a great day. And uh, make sure, if you're not following me on Twitter, follow me on Twitter, at GDubsCollects, and uh, follow me on, uh, subscribe to my channel uh, on YouTube, all right? GDubsCollects there as well. Take care. Have a great day. Keep the hobby alive. Keep on collecting.
Welcome back. What a monster. Monster pull. Um, initially, I all I saw was this gold part right here. I saw, I was like, oh, that looks, that looks a little funny. It's a little bit more gold. I didn't even notice the, if I can get it to shine right. See those little circles? Didn't even notice the super fractor circles, the spirals. Had no idea. I just thought this was gold, one of one. Um, and then I had noticed the, 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 the spirals and I was like, whoa, this is, this is a super fractor. So, yeah, this is easily the most expensive card I've ever pulled in my life. The Jordan Alvarez card for this, let me get this to focus up, the Jordan card of this, which let me know in the comments below if I'm way off base on this. But I think, despite the fact that Jordan is the rookie of the year, the, 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 the reigning as of right now, because Kyle Lewis has not been named yet, he's the reigning rookie of the year. And I still think that Gavin Lux is probably ranked higher and worth more. Because going into this, I ranked it as, for the five chrome variants, Luis Robert, Bo Bichette, Gavin Lux, Jordan, Aquino. Let me know if you agree with me. But that's how I'm seeing this. So at minimum, minimum, this is on par with Jordan at a $3,000 card. So huge card. I want to show you the difference because I also have the 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 regular variant, uh, chrome variant. So obviously everything else is identical on the back. Um, even the, if you can, I, I think it's a... Hail Mary's chance of, of this actually focusing up. No, that's not going to focus up. Um, but even still, that the number is the same, the serial number on the bottom. And, you know, it doesn't say uh, refractor or anything like that. It doesn't say super refractor. So, uh, still chrome, same number. It's just that little fancy little 101. And the gold, obviously the gold as opposed to the rainbow foil. And the spirals, huge. So, um, easily the biggest card I've ever pulled in my life. Not my, uh, not my favorite. Easily the most expensive, I should say. Uh, the biggest card of my life. Uh, you'll see actually in another video once I finally start uh, showcasing my collection. Um, yeah, huge card. Really excited. Can't believe I pulled it. Thirty-seven dollars and fifty cents for this whole box. So, had I taken this box back and returned it, I would have returned the Gavin Lux 1 of 1 because that corner was dinged up. So, as you can see on the card too, it is pristine condition. Not even a... Uh, so this would have been like this. So this corner would have been the one that was compromised. It is absolutely flawless. PSA 10. Easily PSA 10. So, the one of one with a population of one. That's the other thing. This is a $3,000 card raw. It's easily 5000 something like that if I get it graded. But I just, uh, I don't know. With the wait times the way they are, with a card like this, uh, I can't even begin to tell you the anxiety I would have sending this in the mail. Um, so... I most likely will be uh, selling this and um, reinvesting that money. And uh, even if it goes for a lot higher later on, obviously if it goes for a couple, uh, you know, million dollars like the, the Trout Auto uh, <laughs> did, which it won't, it will not, I'm, I'm being facetious. Um, even if it goes for much higher later on, um, I don't think it's necessarily... A terrible um, thing if you make a profit on a card and then you use that money to buy more things that you care about collecting so uh, maybe I'm wrong um, that I think that's the mind of a, uh, a collector rather than a flipper um, 
whereas I buy things to flip so that it pays for the things that I collect. That's generally the, the, the model that I, that I do. So I'll buy, you know, uh, you know, six boxes of this so that I can pay, hopefully get the cards that I want to keep out of these and then sell the rest and it pays for it and, and then I break even. That's really what I'm looking for. So anyway, I just wanted to share this with you all. I know this is a long video, but I feel like it's very worth it. Um, enjoy. This is, uh, this is beautiful. If you know someone that uh, needs to have this card, let me know. Otherwise, I think it's going up on eBay and it's going to get sold. So take care, everyone. Uh, make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter because, like, uh, like I said, this video of me pulling this went up on Instagram first. Um, so there's going to be some exclusive stuff up, uh, up on IGTV. So make sure you check me out there at GDubs Collects, same as uh, same username on Twitter. And make sure you subscribe to this video, share it with anyone um, so that they can see the pulling of the wonderful one of one Gavin Lux Super Refractor. Uh, Super Fractor. So uh, thank you so much. Keep the hobby alive. Keep on collecting.